Tresoses. The website for the now closed Tresoses Tex-Mex restaurant is an older project from about six or seven years ago and one of the first websites I ever made. Tresoses, a Tex-Mex restaurant, did not have a website at the time and I was tasked with creating a web presence with the main goal of building awareness for the restaurant, provide a full menu with prices online, emphasizing the catering business and provide customers a way to contact the restaurant as well as stay in touch via news and special sections. Working with the owner, I was given complete creative freedom for the design and brand of the online presence, except for the logo, three Mexican cartoon characters, and a grungy lettering of the name. I took the actual restaurant itself as inspiration, with its colorful decor and eclectic layout. Working off the feel of the logo type, it was fun to really go wild with as many different quirky fonts as possible, and the results worked surprisingly well. For the logo of the site, I took the three Mexican cartoon drawings and made my own 3D rendition of it with a 3D animation software, Animation Master. Except for some more general stock imagery, I created almost every single visual element from scratch, starting with pictures taken around the restaurant, using PaintShop Pro to process and combine the best bits into building appetizing food images, cool headlines, and creative backgrounds. The banners and backgrounds also change with each page, giving each section of the website a more unique appeal. While initially just tasked with creating a website, I was later asked to also design some print advertisements, as well as tabletop displays. For example, to encourage people to take the online survey, which I also implemented. While I didn't write any real backend for the site, and at the time wouldn't have been able to anyway, I did provide the owner with a method to make quick updates to his site's news and special sections, by including a blogger blog to be displayed in an iframe. For the survey, I implemented a third-party survey tool, again, by displaying it in an iframe. While the restaurant, like most other startups in the restaurant business, didn't make it in the end, Tereso says was a fun project for me, with lots of great visual appeal and, in the time where I knew next to nothing about HTML and CSS, learned the two languages as I went along.